As you girls know, it is the utmost importance for you to find a husband and get married. Yes. yes. So at the ball tonight, I want you both to be on your best behaviors and make a good impression on the bachelor's day. Of course, mother. Sure. I see Jane and Bingley really have hit it off rather well. Yes, they have. Why don't you dance, Darcy? I do not like to dance until I am well acquainted with my partner. Why don't you dance with Elizabeth? She is not handsome enough to tempt me. Elizabeth, why don't you dance with Mr. Darcy? I overheard him say I wasn't pretty enough. He is such a disagreeable man. Hello, Elizabeth. I'm Mr. Collins, the cousin who is going to inherit Polly's property after he dies. Yeah. Nice job. So Elizabeth, are you much acquainted with Mr. Dawson? As much as I ever wish to be, I find him very disagreeable. I do not like him much either. Do you know why? Why? <gasps> this is quite shocking. He deserves to be publicly disgraced. Someday or other he will be, but he will not be by me. Hello Elizabeth. How is your sister Jane doing? Very well. She may be engaged to Mr. Bingley soon. Oh, so she's unavailable. What do you mean? Elizabeth, will you marry me? What? <laughs> Almost as soon as I entered your house, I singled you out as a companion for my future life. But before I run away with my feelings on a subject, I should state my reasons for marrying. Number one. You're too hasty, sir. I am honored, but I cannot otherwise do it must decline your proposal. But Elizabeth! Well, fine then! But how dare you reject Mr. Collins' proposal? You better accept his proposal now or I'll never speak to you again. Elizabeth, Elizabeth, guess what? What? I'm engaged to Mr. Collins. Engaged to Mr. Collins? Impossible! Why are you so surprised? I'm 27. If I don't get married now, I'll never get married. All I want is a comfortable home and Mr. Collins can provide that. But you won't be happy together. My feelings will no longer be repressed. You must allow me to tell you how utterly I admire and love you. Will you marry me? I have never desired your good opinion. No thank you. Why am I thus rejected? Well, let's just say you're the last man on earth I would ever choose to marry. Well, then accept my good wishes for your health and happiness. Elizabeth, I've got terrible news! What is it? Our sister Lydia and Mr. Wickham of Elo. What?